Um, and I seen the Aberdeen result come through, I was a wee bit worried if I'm honest. Um, probably gave the crowd real, real energy, gave the Rangers players real, real energy, because now you could say it's in Rangers' hands, it's in Rangers' hands, whereas previously it wasn't. So you're coming into this game already coming to Ibrox, a difficult game, but with that fresh impetus, knowing that the title's in their hands, it was always that was in the back of my mind. So he's very, very conscious, early doors, that we need to try and make a good start to the game. I genuinely think we did do that, we frustrated. And that's always going to be the game plan. So we frustrated Rangers to very, very little. I don't think Jamal had a lot to do. And then we obviously get the corner conceded. Conceded a few corners, but that one specifically. And I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely, honestly, I'm amazed that VAR's allowed that goal to stand. And that's not me sitting here sour grapes, because Rangers deserve to get three points from the game. I'm not saying we deserve much more than that. But Goldson's foot, foot is head height with Carson. He catches Carson in the thigh on the way down. Carson can't go and attack the ball the way he would, because you can see the the foot coming in, so he's a wee bit apprehensive, and I'm astounded the goal stands, if I'm honest, and up until that point, I don't. I, f I thought our game plan, the structure, the rigidity, when to press, when not to press, when to drop, was very, very good up until that goal, and then the goal gives the players real energy, it gives the crowd real energy, and then we concede a sloppy second.